guys, what's up? It's me, Alicia. Thank you for joining me for another episode of AD's RX for MD. If you haven't done so already, go ahead down below, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you can be notified every single time I post. Today's video is actually a travel vlog. We are taking a four day road trip to one of the schools that I am interested in. Just wanna check out the area, see how comfortable I feel and help me to kind of make the decision on which school I'm gonna to go to. What's up? We have finally made it to our destination. We stopped to get some food because we were hungry and we are a garlic loving family. So we got some garlic and we eat garlic pretty regularly, but this is some strong <laughs> garlic. So we're all just recovering. Um, but yeah, we're here and um, we are gonna do a tour of the apartment complex where I'm thinking of living. So just wanted to let you guys know. Guys, so I am just now realizing I never really ended the day or updated you on how things went. But yeah, we toured the apartments, briefly toured the campus, and just kind of went back to the hotel and we were relaxing. Wasn't a whole lot to share about that. But today we decided we wanted to visit the University Hospital. So that's where we just were. It was really cool because we pulled up shortly after their helicopter had just landed. Um, the hospital actually has a trauma center, which is really impressive. Not every hospital has one, so they get a lot of traumas that come in from surrounding areas. Um, so that was really cool. Christian in my bio but I have not really talked about it in my videos yet but a big part of me deciding where I want to go to school is going to the place that I think God wants me to go that will have me um, come into contact with the people I'm supposed to. In addition to just the things that I like about each school I am praying as well and just asking God to kind of direct me and I do feel he's directing me. I got a wonderful welcome surprise today and I was notified that I have been chosen as a recipient of a scholarship at the school. So that was totally unexpected and especially to receive it while I'm here visiting the school. They don't know I'm visiting. I didn't, you know, they're not doing official tours right now. So I, I'm just really thankful to God and I just think it's kind of pointing me in that direction. Um, so right now we are headed back to campus, ask a few more questions about some of the student housing options and probably look at some of the buildings more, walk around the campus, but uh, we're not really, we don't have any specific plans. We're just figuring it out and scoping the landscape. So 
I will try to be better about giving you guys a summary at the end of the day. But that's it for now. Literally, like I told you, we're just being random. We just kind of saw the student center while we were driving and decided to come in and see what it's like. So, of course, because it's COVID, um, there are a lot of things that are closed. So, yeah, here's, they have most. They, oh, there's a little pizza over there. They have Chick-fil-A and they have um, a Panda Express. So, I'm not going to be weird and record people, but basically, yeah. It's nice. Again, like, seating over there. There's not very many people. I don't know if y'all can hear me, but there's not very many people here, so. All right, guys, it's pretty dark. You can barely see me, but we just finished walking around. Well, we weren't walking. We were driving around campus, just looking at a few of the buildings. We looked at the Performing Arts Center because music is a big deal for me, and sometimes if there are, like, concerts on campus, I just, you know, may want to check that out. So it was really, really nice. We also found the Student Center. They have some uh, pretty good food options in there, so we grabbed some fries from Chick-fil-A just to hold us over while we continue to just drive around campus. And um, we saw a Hungry Howie's, which is one of my favorite pizza places. I absolutely love their deep dish pizza I love Detroit style deep dish pizza with the crispy corners that is one of my favorites ever so of course I had to get it because I just don't see very many hungry howies so we got some and we are going to head back to the hotel and chill for the rest of the night hey sorry forgot my mom reminded me we also have some Greek salad you know try to keep our our arteries clean and wash down all the pizza but yes that's our dinner for tonight hey guys so i am home i didn't really document very much today because um today we just went to church and came home <laughs> pretty much um that was kind of the last thing i had on my agenda was just checking out at least one of the churches in the area um because you know for me your church home is a big deal it's a part of what makes an area feel like home makes you feel comfortable it helps you to create sort of a community that you can rely on um, especially on those weekends for me when I'm going to be kind of stepping away from school a little bit but that went well um, and just the trip in general went really well I'm so glad um, I chose to visit because it really helped to get a lay of the land just see how expansive the campus is see some of the associated hospitals get a feel for you know just the people on campus are they helpful um, yeah, it, it was a really good trip. I enjoyed myself quite a bit, and, um, I think I got a lot of really important questions answered to help me make my decision on what school I want to attend, but this is pretty much the end of this travel vlog. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you guys in the next video.